Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to WWE 2K18, my career mode alternate edition. We're back on SmackDown Live, just one week away from SummerSlam. What a night it will be. And now comes Marcus Polferman. And uh, at Money in the Bank, ladies and gentlemen, two months ago, he attacked The Undertaker out of nowhere after Taker lost the WWE World Heavyweight Championship to Randy Orton. And uh, we haven't seen Taker since then, but Marcus wants to call him out tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, two, um, not too long ago, about a month ago, at Money in the Bank, you may have seen me not defend the United States Championship. At SummerSlam, I will defend the title, however. Now, who I defended against is two men's decision. It could either be Shane's, if the second, is, if the second option doesn't matter, but the second option is The Undertaker. I attacked you from behind after, well, not even from behind, I attacked you straight to your face after you lost to Randy Orton for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Now, if you want another title, one title that you've never won in the WWE, if you want the United States Championship, I insist you come out right now. You might think this is just a grudge just because you didn't defend the title at WrestleMania, but at this point, it's beyond that. You have been ignoring me for months, and now I have finally reached my breaking point. I've hunted you down. That's why you people didn't see me at Great Balls of Fire. I've been hunting down the dead man with no prevail. If you want to see a monster taker, if you want to see me get at my worst, then you come out here and you keep, you keep ignoring me. And then you'll see me do my worst. One thing I'll be aiming for is your brother Kane. So Undertaker, if you don't attack me, or even even have a response for me, I will break Kane's neck. I swear to God, I will break his neck. So Undertaker, bring your ass out here right now. Maybe, maybe this is the night the Undertaker comes out. That could be it. That could be the Undertaker! Oh no. That's not the Undertaker. Wow. That's not the Undertaker and look at Marcus. He must be livid. Oh my god! Oh my god, and Mark is kicking Tyler Breeze's phone. Oh, look at Tyler Breeze now. Fighting back somehow. Big kick by Tyler Breeze. Maybe he's done his homework on Marcus. Oh, look at this though. Boom, drop kick. And look at that. Tyler Breeze now getting back up to his feet. Mark is taking his time to get back inside the ring here. And look at this. The match is underway. Here we go. Boom. Lift inverted DDT right off the bat. And look at that. Marcus is livid. This is the second time this has happened. And look at that spinning heel kick. Marcus Pulferman is not in a good mood. Another drop kick. Marcus is already just throwing Tyler Breeze around right here. Look at this. Oh my god, Tyler Breeze going straight to the ground right there. Oh, and look at this now. Tyler Breeze perhaps able to get some offense. Oh, and look at that. Just straight away reversing. And look at this. Tyler Breeze now with a reversal. Of course, you gotta remember Tyler Breeze has more talent. But look at that. Tyler Breeze has more talent than most of the roster. So he does stand a better chance than Mojo Rawley did. But look at this now. Boom. No. Tyler Breeze reversing. But look at Marcus now. Wow. Oh, my God. Another spinning heel kick. And Marcus is going to hook the leg. One. Kick out. 
by Tyler Breeze. But now Marcus is setting up for the Leviathan kick. Boom! And he gets it. And look at that. What's he doing here? Oh my god. Just showing off right here. Wow. And look at this. Marcus Polferman now setting it up. Here we go. Boom! And he's going to lock in the last will. Will Tyler Breeze tap? A lot of people have tapped to this very hold, and he's forced to tap. Marcus Polferman with a defiant win right here tonight. A great win for Marcus Polferman. Oh my god, that's the dead man! He's being appeared out of nowhere! Marcus fight it back! Oh, look at this! Marcus finally gets his hands on the Undertaker in the middle of the ring! Forearm! Oh, and look at Undertaker! Oh, another big punch! And another one! Look at these strikes! The Undertaker! Oh my god, just dropping him on the ropes! The Undertaker has returned to SmackDown Live! And he's looking to make a statement right here. Tombstone Pile Driver, The Undertaker, makes a statement. We'll see you guys at SummerSlam. What a night it's going to be. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've just received news that the United States Championship will be on the line at SummerSlam. Marcus Pofferman is going to go one-on-one -on -one with The Undertaker with the added stipulation that if Marcus Pofferman loses, he gets shipped to Monday Night Raw. With, because with the other stipulation of Jordy and Zack, whoever loses, goes to SmackDown Live, they're going to have a little swap with whoever loses. So, of course, if The Undertaker loses, he goes to Monday Night Raw. If Marcus loses, he not only does he lose the United States Championship, but he also loses his spot on SmackDown Live. But, yeah, with that said, guys, I want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of WWE 2K18 My Career Mode Alternate. If you liked it, hit that like button as hard as possible can. Comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out. And see ya.